All right, perfect. Man, I missed all the beginning stuff. Man. All right, anyway. <laughs> if you simply share this opportunity with one other person, your membership is free. So instead of, yeah, you're going to still pay that $100 every month to the person that introduced you to this platform, but the person that you introduce it to, they're paying you directly 100% commission directly to you on a, on a monthly basis. So, I mean, is that, is that awesome? Is that awesome? That's, that's, that's great. And I will tell you from personal experience from being in other like network marketing and affiliate programs, generally it's not the first person that's going to break you even. Generally, you need to go out there and recruit about five to 10 people before you even break even. So that's one of the reasons at least to get one person, at least one, so that you break even with our affiliate company. Okay. Uh, it says how to fully turn on the other two income faucets to the H2F program and how to cut their personal customized P390 Forex 90 day goal in half. Um, the P390 Forex, somebody asked that question, I think today or yesterday, and I responded to it in the Telegram group where they said, um, okay, I'm going to start my account with $100 and should I be depositing money into my Forex account as I go? And I said, most definitely, if you can, or you should, it's a definitely an advantage to you. Because the beautiful part about those investment accounts that you have with Traders Way, the more money that's in there is the more money that you're going to make. Simple as that. Now, we're all doing the same thing. Generally, all of us are taking the same exact trades. So when you see in our Facebook group, people posting their profits, you see they closed out on GBP USD, USD DKK, EUR USD, and you see that you closed out on that as well. But maybe like, for, for example, Lawrence puts his post in there and he had, at one point said, uh, this week he said, so far for the week, I made, $2,200, $2,200. And you said, well, man, I took those same signals that Lawrence took, but I only made 20 bucks. <laughs> I took the same trades that Lawrence took. It took me the same amount of time to click sell or click buy. What was the difference? Lawrence has more money in his Forex brokerage account. That's the only difference. That's, that's what I love about this. Forex movement, this Forex thing. Like I said before, it's a system. You do the same thing over and over and over again, but the more money in there, the more money it's gonna make you. So back to the benefits of building a team. As you guys build those teams, as you're making money from the business owner side of this opportunity, you're able to take that money and deposit it maybe all of the money or some of the money or whatever the case, but you're able to take that money and deposit it into your Forex account so that it gets you to your goals faster. It gives you more leverage. So now you're able to increase your lot sizes because now you have more money in there. The more money in there, the more money that's going to make you in return. The return on your investments, simple wealth principles, all right? So that's another benefit of saying, let me share this opportunity with others. Okay, now, what we also did here on the Highway to Freedom that has nothing to do with National Wealth Center, but from the simple fact that we understand the essence of community. I always talk about, like sometimes I'll bring up the fact like in New York, there's a heavy Jewish influence. And, you know, I'm just speaking from facts or whatever, not picking on any background in case we have anybody Jewish that's on. But the Jewish community, they tend to keep their community tight. They tend to 
spread the wealth within their own communities. So you will see they have their own stores, they have their own schools, they have their own police, their own uh, ambulance, hospitals. They have their own tight community, which allows them to circulate the money within the community. I once heard a saying that um, within the Jew Jewish community, the money circulates 11 times before it even leaves the community. And then I think about different or other communities where you make that dollar and you're so quick to spend it outside of the community. So thinking about that, now here we're not going to open our own, you know, police and hospitals and schools. That's not, we're not, we're not going there with it. But what we, what, what we were doing, what we've set up as a, as a benefit for each and every single one of you of getting that simple four people that you bring on. Because there's, there's power in four here if you were to recruit four people. So if you were to recruit four people, let me just read it here. As a member gains access to the quad squad. You become a quad squad member. We have a few quad squad members so far. So a member gains access to the quad squad by recruiting four other people to the opportunity. As a bonus, members who reach the quad squad in their first four weeks receive a $100 give back from their sponsor to be placed in the quad squad members investment account and become fully qualified in the National Wealth Center creation level, okay? Wealth creation level. So what we're gonna do on top of you already making the money from bringing in four people to the platform, what we're gonna do, whoever sponsored you, whoever introduced you to the platform, they're gonna throw you $100 back. See what I'm saying? Keeping that money circulating through the community. They're gonna give you $100 back that you can also throw in your investment account. This as a pat on the back, as a saying, way to go. You got four people that you introduce or share the opportunity with in your first four weeks. Got it? All right, so that's the benefit of becoming a Quad Squad member. And that's what you will get if you become a Quad Squad member in your first four weeks, okay? The next benefit, now, you become a Quad Squad member, you're going, you're building your account. Um, there's the opportunity to also become a Continental member. A member becomes a Continental member once he or she has at least $1,500 in their investment account and also is a member of the Quad Squad. Continental members, they pretty much have brought 100% all the way in. They're here to stay, you know, they, they're all the way in 100%. So as leadership here, we can, kind of invest more time into helping you see these charts the way we see the charts and helping you grow. It, you know, it becomes more than just you following the signals. We want to really help you maximize on your knowledge of these Forex. So we also open up an exclusive, we have an exclusive signal channel where we put out commodity and exotic pairs. So commodities are like oil, you're able to trade gold, you're able to trade gold, different pairs like that, silver. And generally you make more money quicker off of those pairs because they move, there's a lot of volatility with those pairs. So, you know, the money, or you make more money per pip on a lot of those exotic pairs. So if you guys remember, USD DKK that we took, I think was this week, that we, we closed out on this week, we only closed about 28 pips on that pair. But if you guys were kind of paying attention on some of you veterans who are here, you probably realize that you made more money on those 28 pips than you pretty much made on maybe a GBP USD that would have moved 28 pips. So we give out those, and you know, technically I wasn't really supposed to give the team the USD DKK, but I did, all right? But um, that's, that's the advantage of that. There's also a trade dynamic indicator that we give the team for becoming continental members. And what the trade dynamic indicator does, it tells you when the market is oversold. So when the market is oversold, it's a great chance that you should be looking for sales. 
when the market is oh well, sorry when the market is oversold it's a great chance that you should be looking for buys when the market is overbought there's a great chances that you should be looking for sales and this indicator tells you that and you pretty much really don't even have to look at the charts you can look at that indicator and determine the direction you should be going okay oh uh, give me one second we got a question a chat thank you for the usd dkk <laughs> no problem alina no problem no problem all right the art of taking signals advanced course now with our continental members we also give an advanced course where literally these type of webinars like we have a couple of webinars that we do now, like the Monday Art of Taking Signals webinar, the Sunday night webinar for new people, and we have this webinar on Thursday nights for how to build a team. What we also do for Continental members, I have a webinar where we look at the charts together. So you guys will literally be able to see the charts, we can trade together, talk about what I'm seeing, so that you really truly understand why I'm making the calls and the signals that I'm making so that you can kind of, you know, and even ask the questions. We're just basically hanging out together, breaking down the charts, analyzing the charts together. And how easy would it be for you to really pick up and grasp our strategy and system if we're doing it live together? Yeah, we have our YouTube channel and I recorded some of those videos and some of the videos we kind of picked out of the YouTube world that fit our strategy, but how much easier would it be if we can analyze and break it down together live in action where you can ask questions right there on the spot. Well, Shane, what about this? What about that? What about this? So we also have that webinar for the Continental members, okay? And these are some of the benefits of becoming a, or well, building a team basically outside of the fact that you're going to make more money and have multiple streams of income all right so 9 30 you guys i do talk a lot and i'm gonna try to doris does an awesome job of keeping this within an hour i'm gonna try my best <laughs> i'm gonna try my best so um let's go to our entourage page now we have it set up where everything is broken out for you you can simply follow the system by simply going right here, go to www.h2fentourage.com. So we're going to go there right now and follow that system. I'm going to try to, I'm basically going to break down this page for you and see if we can make this thing so easy, so smooth for everybody where you're building your team effortlessly. That's, that's what I like to talk about, effortlessly. That's the key word, effortlessly, because that's how I'm pretty much building my team at this point. Without much effort. I don't like calling people and saying, hey, man, I got this opportunity. You want to get down? I'm trading the floor right da, 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 da. I don't like that. I've been in different um, network marketing opportunities before. Where I saw the vision. I believed in it 100%. And I'm like, man, if I can just get these people to join me, man, we can all just blow up. And especially when they're like my closest friends and they don't buy into it. I start to almost not like them anymore. <laughs> I'm like, damn, man. You didn't want to get down with me? Come on. You'll go to the club, hang out with me, and you'll, you'll buy booze, you'll buy liquor and all this stuff for me, but you won't take a small investment and join something positive with me? What's up with you? And then I stop talking to them and whatever. <laughs> and it's not supposed to be like that. It's not supposed to be like that. So that's why I love what we've been doing here because it's effortlessly. It's designed and set up in a way where people are coming to you instead of you having to track down and dog down and call them every year all the time. Hey, man, and people start ignoring your phone calls and all that. Like, oh, you're trying to get me signed up and something. You know what I mean? Our goal here is to have this in a way, again, that people are calling you. Okay? So if you follow this, entourage page that we have h2fentourage.com that's the way it should be because you got the juice guys you have the juice you are making money whether they sign up with you or not so your attitude towards building this team is you can join me or you can't if you don't it's your loss your loss so you don't have to dog down anybody as time goes along as your lifestyle changes as your bank account increases, as you have success, 
trust and believe, they will come. There's a proverb that says, if you build it, they will come. And that's the idea here. So at the, before I go digging into what we're about to talk about, just remember, you keep on having success here. You keep on following those signals. You keep on building those accounts. You keep on learning how to trade this Forex. Your success will naturally have people tracking you down. Trust and believe, all right? So, okay. So, step number one says make a list of potential candidates. That's important. That's, you know, pretty straightforward, pretty standard. The larger your list, the more opportunities you give yourself to build your team. Because believe me, everybody that you write in your list is not going to sign up. But it's a pure numbers game. It's pure uh, the, the law of averages. The more people on there, the more opportunities you give yourself to get people to sign up. Lawrence did a great job last week of covering this topic. Um, where you can go on your cell phone. A lot of us have hundreds of people on our cell phone. So you can literally make that list right out of your cell phone. Um, it could be people that you work with, like I've been able to work with a lot of people that I've a lot of people that I've shared this opportunity with are the people that I was already working with. Some of you know me, you know my background, or we work together. With insurance, you know, I was able to, like, you know, Lawrence, uh, uh, King Aziz, uh, we all sold life insurance together. So we were already tight. We were already had a connection and a bond. It was easy to talk to them and let them know what I'm doing. And they naturally came with me because they know what I was doing with them with insurance because we were doing it together. So if it was something powerful enough to get my, grab my attention away from the insurance, they said, I'm sure they were telling themselves that, well, it must be something good, you know, because I was having success with the insurance, not that I was down and out. Same thing with the people that you work with, guys. They see you every day. They, like I said, they're going to see your lifestyle change, and that's one of the easiest people to share this opportunity with. So make that list. Another group of people, your family, another set of people that's very close to you. They know you. They, you know. As you have success, put those people on your list and, and so forth. But the most important part is make the list. Now, number two, this is the powerful part, unlike traditional network marketing. Number two says, put them in the H2F Facebook page prior to the Sunday webinar invite. If they have any questions, great, tell them, all will be answered on the Sunday invite webinar if I can secure you an invite. Keyword, if I can secure you an invite. Now, first, let's talk about that Facebook page. I'm sure all of you by now are in our Facebook page. And let me go pull that up while we talk so we can see the power of the Facebook page. I'm sure all of you are in our Facebook page, and some of you may have been in our Facebook page before you even joined us. And some of you probably saw the activity in that Facebook page and was one of the things that motivated you to join us. So if that's you, then you understand the power of our Facebook page. But this Facebook page right here, is the way you recruit or share the opportunity without having the dog people down. Five, 10 years ago or before the Facebook era, network marketing did go on, but they did not have the advantage of the Facebook group. It was more getting on that phone and calling people and make your list was always number one. The number two would be start calling them <laughs> and i've done that kind of network marketing as well and it's not always fun especially after you go through your three your first four or five people and they all giving you the run around it gets very discouraging very fast 
Not saying that that doesn't work. And, and I encourage you guys to do that as well. It works. It does work. You just have to have tough skin sometimes. And those of you who do have that tough skin will make even more money. But for those of you who do not feel like, like me, I really don't feel like calling people, especially because I've called them for other opportunities before. So with me, it's probably like, oh, here we go again. Shane trying to do something else. I'm good, Shane. Nah, nah, I'm good. You know what I mean? So those of you who don't feel like dealing with that, all you have to do is put them in our Facebook group. Now, the way I used to do it, I used to just, because, you know, once you go to add a member, there's, right here it says add member. I think it's a little bit different on your cell phone. Your whole friend list pops up. The whole friend list that you have on Facebook. And a lot of us have more Facebook friends than we have contacts in our cell phone. But your whole friend list pop up. Now, the way I used to do it, I used to just put everybody in there. Just put them in there. I wouldn't ask them or nothing. I just put them in there. But I learned from Aziz, one of our teammates, and I'm sure most of you have seen his name. You know, he's having a lot of success with us. Let me just tell you, he started in February, $100, and he's over $8,000 now, man. I'm so excited in under five months. All right, I just like bragging on the team. <laughs> yeah, man, he's killing the game with us. But what he does with the Facebook, he'll reach out to his friends first at least and say, hey, man, I'm doing this awesome thing with Forex making money. He might give a little testimonial. I started in a, a February with $100. I'm over $8,000 now, and it's kill I'm killing it, man. I'm about to live my life on a whole nother level because of this Forex thing. What I want to do, I just want to put you in our group so you can kind of see what we're doing. And if, you know, if it's ever something you're interested, just reach out to me. Boom! That's it. And so in the introduction tonight, Lawrence had put it out for the night's nice meeting. He said tonight's topic would be on peaking the interest and that exactly what i just said there was peaking the interest now you have your own personality your own style the way you talk but that's what you can kind of do whether it's through the messenger on facebook or whether you call them directly and talk to them and say hey i'm doing this awesome thing with forex i'm having some success i'm making some money and we got this facebook group and i just want to put you in there so you can kind of see what's going on. And if you're ever interested, hey, give me a call and uh, I'll put you on or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Something kind of like that. And you put them in the group and then the next step of that process happens. But remember that part, though. Simple as that. Put them in the group. Now, if you're like me, you just throw them in there. What will happen next, because we always encourage you guys to share your profits, share your testimonials, or anything positive that we're doing with the Forex here. So your friends are in that group, and what will happen, they're like, whoa. Because there's a lot of Facebook groups out there, you guys know. Some are good and some are bad. Some are positive, some are negative. I'm in a few of them. There's some interesting Facebook groups out there, if you know what I mean. <laughs> All right, so... Imagine they're in all these other Facebook groups and they're in their regular Facebook and all this crazy stuff going in the world that people share. But they got this one group where they're seeing people making money. And they see the day you made $100, two months down the road, they see that $100 now is $1,000 you made. And if they're still waiting, they'll see you making $1,000 on a daily basis where like a Lawrence in a couple of days in the week, he's already on $2,200. That was like Tuesday or something, Monday or Tuesday that Lawrence said, I'm up $2,200 for the week. And that's your friends, they're following you. And then they see that it's not only you that's making money, it's your peers in the group also making money. Because one thing if you're making the money, but when they see other people making money as well, they're like, whoa, 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 wait a minute. And they know where you work. Maybe you have a good job, maybe you don't. They say, man, she's making this kind of money. He's making this kind of money. I don't know what the hell they're doing, but I know they're making money and they're excited. And it's a few of them, it's a group of them making money. Guess what happens, guys? You just keep posting your results in that group. That's it. And you put your friends in there. That's how they start reaching out to you. They might reach out to you as a personal message. They might call you, but best believe they start reaching out to you. Another thing that I do, 
because it seemed like I, I put a lot of people in the group and after a while it kind of like you know for, you get you start to get people that respond and, respond and hit you up then it might start to mellow out where then you're not getting that kind of response anymore nobody's asking you anymore <laughs> so what I also do is I make friends by joining other financial groups or positive groups like I'm in a group called Black Economic Coalition. I'm in a group called Wall Street something. I'm in other Forex groups. So I'll go in those groups and send friend requests out to certain people that I see are doing positive things in those groups. Or people that I see, I might join groups that say work from home. Or just different business mindset groups. People that I feel have the same mindset that we do as far as growing financially. And I make friends with them. And then I put them in the group once I make friends with them with that same peaking the interest type of mindset. So I'll send them a, a message and say, hey man, thanks for accepting my friend request. Uh, man, I love making friends with like-minded individuals. I'm also doing something that's positive with the Forex markets and we have a a Facebook group that I don't think you would like being in, or I want to put you in. And they say, okay, no problem. Cool. Thanks for sending me a friend request, something, you know, you know, general conversation. And then I put them in the group. So when you run out of friends, make more friends. Simple as that. Because that's one of the things people talk about with network marketing. I don't have that many friends. I don't got all these people to talk to. We'll go out there and make them. It's Facebook. All you do have to do is send a friend request and send a little peak the interest type of message. Peaking the interest. Hey, I see you in a positive group and you're doing, and I like to make them feel good. I like to say positive things about them. Hey, I see you making positive moves. I like, I like connecting with like-minded people like yourself. I'm also doing something positive with the Forex market. I'm not sure if you're familiar with it, but I like to put you in our group so maybe you can take a look. And if it's something you're interested in, you can always reach out to me. Simple. And you don't have to make a phone call to do that because Facebook has the messenger right here. How they say, hit me in my DM. Go hit them in the DM, baby. Hit them in the DM. <laughs> All right? And you can make friends and put them in there as well. And then you simply post your profits. And your friend. that's why we encourage everybody on the team to post their profits. Because look, if I put my friends in that Facebook group, and you're putting your friends in that Facebook group, and I post my profits, guess what? I'm also helping you. If you post your profits, you're also helping me. So in turn, it helps us solidate that thing we always talk about, one team, one dream. You see what I'm saying? Because we're helping each other through this Facebook group. It's not about people just want to show off. Oh, they just showing off. They just showing off. No. There's a method to the madness, like you guys might hear me say sometimes. There's truly a method to the madness. So if you don't believe me, one of our teammates, Zakaya, I don't know if she's on tonight, but I don't know what, how she's getting a lot of people that are literally going in the Facebook group and saying, hey, I'm ready to get started. I'm ready to make money. Somebody help me get going. And she's following exactly what we're talking about. Some of you probably know the names of Kaya because she talks in the Telegram, and she's also active in the Facebook group. She's gotten to the point now that she's not only posting her profits, but she's posting other positive things. She's making herself a beacon, a light. That's why I talk about keep shining your light. Keep waving the flag of success so other people can use it as a compass of where to go. Like the Chinese proverb, if you build it, they will come. So by you literally posting, it's like you opening up your store. You're cutting on the lights to your store. By simply being active in our Facebook group, people will notice you. I know for sure because I was talking to somebody else that I brought onto the team, and I had mentioned Zakaya because she, I think she had posted some results. And they were like, oh, yeah, I see her. I see her reposting in the group. I know her. I see her, I see her, I see her. See? So let's take a look, if you don't believe me. <laughs> so look what's going on, lady. J. 
Jay Johnson, I think Fumi brought this guy in. Thank you for the invite. I'm ready to share, learn, and grow. Thanks again. Look at that. I think Fumi brought this guy in. Let's go down a little bit more. Christopher Lawrence, I need to learn what this is all. <laughs> Okay, but anyway, I need to learn what this is all about. Zakaya brought him in. And so when I see stuff like that, because, you know, I got a little bit of free time on my hands, and I like to help you guys. I like to help promote you guys. So I go in there. I see you were brought in by Zakaya. She has 100% of the facts and is killing the game with us. She will point you in the right direction and make a determination if you are a good fit for our community. Boom, look what happened right after that. This guy comes in and says, me too. So Zakaya is starting to get swamped with people that she's putting in the group, and literally that's all she does is put them in the group, show her results, the team shows her results, and now she has to do the next part is follow up. That's it. Follow up with the people who are putting messages like this right here. If I go down a little bit more, this guy said, where am I? That was interesting. But believe it or not, I think Zakaya brought him in too. And I, you know, said some funny stuff. The street you're on is called the Highway to Freedom. <laughs> and lately, guys, we've been getting a lot of these type of, a lot of these type of responses. Thanks for the ad. I'm ready to learn. Zakaya brought him in. And remember, I was telling you earlier about Zakaya. She put out this video, the Castle Quadrant. Boom! She posted that. Which side are you on? We're a team, and we're investors. One team, one dream. She's setting herself up to be a beacon of light for the opportunity that we have. And it's not just a kite, don't get me wrong. A lot of us do, a lot of us do. Like Camille today, she posted her, her, her account. She's starting to set herself up to be a beacon of light. And I'm sure she has her friends in the group as well that's gonna see what she's doing. Now, yeah, in, in this case right here, her trades were against the 30, now $31, but uh, guess what? They see the down $31. It could be tomorrow that the, when we close out on some profits or next week, whenever it is, then they see her up $200, $300. It's like, whoa. But well, she's setting herself up to be that beacon of light so people can follow her. She's peaking the interest. That's what this Facebook group is all about, peaking the interest without you having to call and dog people down and deal with adversity and deal with rejection. No, just put them in the group. They will watch, they're watching. Like we say, build it and they will come. I'm sure there's more. Look, Marcus Harris, I'm ready to get this money, baby. So I think I think Zakaya brought him in too, if I'm not mistaken. So honestly, I don't know how she's getting so many people to come in there and actually ask to get going, but she has some type of knack. Let me see if she's on here. Let me see if she, maybe she can share with us. Let me see something. Okay, no, she, I don't see her on tonight. But yeah, people, but I, um, I say I don't know, but I literally, she's just putting them in the group and we're, you know, can someone explain how this works? I'm interested in getting extra money. Inbox me. Zakaya also brought him in there. Good evening. How does this work? Good afternoon, people. Somebody help. You see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying, guys? And this has been happening over the last couple of weeks where now we're starting to get these people that's asking. They're like feeding out. I need it. I need it. I need it. I need it. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? It is truly a team effort. It's truly a team effort. It's because you guys are posting in there and showing your results. Especially when you get, we have like our, our guy like Lawrence who posts these type, of, these type of things like this. This is my balance for the week. You know, he's showing his balance, 2,200. That was um, yesterday, $2,200 for the week. So when people see that, they're like, whoa, get out of here. You see what I'm saying? And this is how we make this recruiting process so smooth. All right, I'm getting carried away. So let's go back to the entourage page. I think you guys get that point. That's the essence of using, our, using Facebook to build effortlessly. Really what it's about is to pique the interest. That's the essence of using Facebook to pique the interest effortlessly. Keyword, effortlessly without you having to dog people down and make all these 100 million phone calls and deal with all these different type of rejections and things of that nature that traditional 
network marketing you will have to face. And they're gonna tell you, you're just gonna have to deal with it. Just deal with it. If you wanna build, if you wanna grow, if you wanna make money, rejection is a part of it. And I never did like that part of network marketing. I always understood the power of network marketing and affiliate marketing, but I never liked having to deal with that rejection. Ironically, I come from a sales background, but nobody likes to deal with rejection. I don't care how good sales you are, all right? So you put them in the Facebook group. What do we do next? So they're in the Facebook group, and when they start putting, like, like they start asking questions like they're asking, now, a lot of you get people asking you questions, but they don't put it in the Facebook group like that. They might send you, they might hit you in the DM. They might send you a private message in your Facebook Messenger. Hey, man, what's this thing you got going on with this Forex or whatever y'all making? I don't know what the world y'all doing, but what it's all about. That's when step three comes in. Send them the webinar invite only two days before and confirm their attendance. So naturally, the next, if somebody does that naturally, naturally, you want to start explaining it. And hey, man, this is Forex and you can follow some signals and we got this going on and blah, 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 blah. The problem with that is that you might not know the opportunity as well as, let's say, as a me or the leaders who've been here for a little bit longer than you. Or you might not be able to explain it as eloquently. Now, I don't want to say that because a lot of you probably can explain and talk more eloquent than me. That's, I don't consider that to be my forte. I'm just kind of shooting out for the tongue. You know, you guys probably see my Friday videos or whatever, and I just kick it. I'm not, I don't try to come off as so, I try, but you know, Shane don't end up coming out at the end of the day. But the whole point is, it always looks better when somebody else other than yourself can explain the opportunity for a couple of reasons. One of the reasons is, these folks, they, they, they might look at you as, well, that's a shame, man. You just sell life insurance agent. You know, what are you going to tell me about the opportunity? They might be curious, but when it comes to explaining, it looks better if somebody else can do the explaining for you that can make you look good, that could be like a little beacon, especially if they know you just started, like, you know. So the Sunday Night Opportunity Overview webinars are designed to let the leaders do the work for you. And again, it goes right back to what we say about making it effortless, where they, you pique their interest, they ask you about joining or whatever, next you wanna steer them to our Sunday Night Opportunity Overview webinar. So we give you the exact words you can use in blue right here. So you can say something like, this is an exclusive invite-only webinar. Invite-only. So what we call that in sales, is the takeaway, the fear of loss. You want to make them feel like, oh man, shh, I hope I can get on, man. I hope they put me on. Oh, they invite on. I hope I can invite it. I hope I can invite it. You want to kind of make them fiend out a little bit, you know? You don't want to come like, oh yeah, please, can you join? Come, yeah, come on, come on to the webinar. Please, please, please. I need some people. I need some people. You don't want to come off like that because then it, it feels like, ah, oh, well, they, then that, that resistance building. You don't. You already piqued their interest. You don't want to kill it by fiending out for them. You want them fiending out for you. That's why we use keywords like this is an exclusive invite only webinar. I only get a certain amount of invites for Sunday webinar and I have chosen you. You see those keywords? I only get a certain amount of invites for the Sunday webinar and I've chosen you. Those type of words will also kind of ensure that you get a higher rate of people that attend it. Because believe it or not, you have people that come to you and say what this is all about and you invite them to the webinar, but I promise you not all of them are gonna attend that either. It's still a numbers game, it's still a law of averages, but these little key words can kind of help you put that law of averages in your favor. So I only get a certain amount of inv invites for the Sunday webinar and I have chosen you. I have chosen you. Doesn't that make me feel special? Oh man, you chose me. Thanks, Tiff. Thanks, Selena. Oh man, wow, she chose me. So if somebody chose you, don't you feel like now you have some, some sort of responsibility to them to at least show up? Come on, man, I chose you. I didn't even have to cho choose you. 
only get a certain amount of invites and you don't even show up. You see what I'm saying? So you kind of like putting some responsibility on them to show up. But then you give them an out. If you're not going to make it, let me know no later than Sunday by 10 a.m. So others on the waiting list, <laughs> this is awesome, man. So others on the waiting list can take your spot instead. You're taking it back away from them. You're taking it away. If you're not going to show up, at least let me know by 10 a.m. on Sunday so that other people that I have on the waiting list can take your spot instead. Now, you're saying that what you unconsciously, un, the unconscious or the subconscious message that you're sending to them by saying it like that is that, hey, if you don't get down, I got a list of other people that's waiting. Look, when you go to the club, those of you who've been to the club ever in your life, that line that you see outside the club, it's not always because there's a, real, a true line. Sometimes they intentionally make people wait outside the club so that people driving by or walking by can look and say, man, that must be the hot spot. Look at the line around the block. I got to get up in there. Whoa, look at that line. A lot of times, guys, that's what it's all about. The bouncer could just let them in. All they got to do is pay the money and go in. But they want to create that ambiance, that like, whoa, there's a line. So remember, if you build it, they will come. This is your business. Think about this business as a store. So we want to put a line outside of our store to get this hot product. So we say words like, no later than Sunday by 10 a.m. Let me, if you're not going to make it, let me know. No later than Sunday by 10 a.m. So others on the waiting list can take your spot instead. Look at that word, take your spot. Nobody wants their spot to be taken. Take my spot? What? No, nah, no, nah, I'll be there. Don't worry. I'll be there. Sunday, what time? 9 o'clock? I'll be there. I'll be there. Because they don't want their spot to be taken. You see? Key words, guys. Key words will help transition that number from the people that you talk to that actually show up to the webinar. Because I know some of you have been talking to the people. And I know some of you may have dealing with some things where, oh, man, I thought I had 10 people I talked to and nobody showed up. Only one person showed up. What's going on? I don't know. I don't know. I encourage you to try these little, little shifts in what you're saying and see the difference of results you get of people coming up. And be strong about it. Be strong about it because know in your heart when you talk to people, they need what you have. You have the juice. So when you talk to people, you talk like that. Some of you guys are getting awesome results from what you're doing here. You're taking your accounts from hundreds of dollars, and now you're on thousands of dollars. And believe it or not, we're just getting started. Wait till your account is 10000 or 20000 when you're trading that standard account, and you too can say it's Tuesday, and I've already made $2,200. You're not going to need anybody. So act like that. Carry yourself like that. Talk like that to the people that you're talking to now so that you you know, it's just the feeling that you're going to unconsciously rub off on them that, whoa, this shit, man, whoa. You know what I'm saying? You can't come off like you're feeling out for them. So you got to walk and talk like that. You know, it's, it's like you can, you know, sometimes the, the ugly girl, but she's so attractive because of her confidence. She's not the best looking thing in the world, whatever, but her confidence and the way she carries herself makes me like, damn, something about her. I just want to hang out with her at least. Something about her, you know? And that's kind of the essence of the way you carry yourself with this opportunity. They need you. At the end of the day, they need you. And you're going to make it without them regardless, with or without them. All right? All right. So now to get on the webinar, step four is the follow-up, which is also very important. The follow-up. Ask what they like most about the webinar. Keyword, what did you like most about the webinar? Not, so what did you think? Because if there was something that they didn't like, that's what they're going to bring up. Yeah, it was a good webinar, but this whole recruiting thing, I'm not sure about this thing, man. It's recruiting. Now you set yourself up in a position where you have to deal with that. So you ask questions and you're kind of gearing it to the things that you want to deal with. So if you ask them what did you like most, they're going to tell you what you like, they like most. Now you're going to be talking about positive things. You're going to be dealing with a positive responses. You're not saying, well, what do you think? 
You know what I'm saying? You're saying, what did you like the most about the webinar? And what that is, setting you up to get their hot buttons. If any of you have sales background, you understand what a hot button is. Everybody has a hot button. Like, people have a spot, well, this is a hot button. <laughs> All right, sorry guys, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> The hot button, you see? Their why. Then, and whatever they say, you agree with them. If they say, oh man, I like the fact that I can turn my cell phone into an ATM machine. So what I would say to that, you know what, man, that's exactly what I was doing, why I joined too. Because, you know, I can be out here and go to work every day and still be making money right off my cell phone. Man, you're going to do this good with us. because That's one of the reasons I joined too. It doesn't matter what they say, you agree with them. You are aligning yourself on their side. They feel like it's making yourself a partner with them. You see what I'm saying? That's their why though. Then you would go into, after you got that hot button and you got out some positive talk, what was their biggest concern, if any, about the opportunity? And guys, you can literally just, if you call them, you can literally pull up this website, this h2fentourage.com and read right down the list, because I do. I just go in, I come right here and I read the questions. Read it. They don't know you're reading off the uh, computer. So you go, what was your biggest concern, if any, about the opportunity? If any. What that does is find the hidden resistance. Because sometimes there is some resistance. Sometimes they're not always sure. So, you know, we got some skeptical people out here. So that gives you the opportunity to smoothly find out what the resistance may be. Next question. Could they see themselves fitting in with the, our community if selected? See that keyword, if selected. Remember, you have the juice. You want to align yourself as I don't need you. You might not even get selected here. And if you guys are attending our Sunday night webinars, you will notice the leadership. Our conversation, more and more you notice, is structured in a way that we try to let people know that we don't need you. You might not be selected, even if you go on our Facebook group. Look, I said something intentionally in that Facebook group in response to um, one of Zakai's people. And I'm doing it over and over. It's intentional. There's a method to the madness. Let me find it so you guys will see what I'm talking about. Look, I see you were brought in by Zakai. She has 100% of the facts and is killing the game with us. She will point you in the right direction and make a determination if you are a good fit for our community. I'm doing these type of things on purpose. That didn't happen to come out like that. And I want that energy and attitude to spread throughout the team. I want you all to have that type of attitude that we don't need everybody, because you don't. You don't need everybody here. Because you know some people, look, we, you gotta follow signals. You have to be able to pay attention, follow directions. You have to be, be able to be a team player. And if you're not, if the, the person is not that kind of person, they can't follow, follow, uh, follow directions and you know pay attention and be a team player we don't want them here we don't want them here and the more you have that type of attitude the more people are going to fiend for you and run you down instead of you having to run them down so right there c says you ask them could you see yourself fitting our community if selected the next one ask them what their answers to the three closeout questions now at every Sunday night opportunity overview webinar, Femi closes out with these three powerful questions. Again, powerful questions. Does your money work wait before you, or do you have to wake up to get more money? Does your money work when you're not? Example on a vacation, sick days, or simply a day off. Does your money still work when you want to take a vacation or when you want to take a sick day? And the last but not least, Many people work overtime, but what about your money? Is your money working overtime? Then he always closes out the webinar to set up you guys or set, up, set us all up to be able to respond to our candidates with those questions. We encourage the candidates on the webinar to write those questions down. We tell them, write the questions down because the answers to these questions are gonna be what determines whether whoever invited you on the webinar thinks you are a good fit for our community. So those three questions are very important. Nine times out of 10, nine and a half times out of 10, 
they're not going to be able to answer yes to all three of these questions. So if they're answering no to these questions, and nine times out of ten they're answering no to all those questions, there's a great chance, not saying nine, but there's a great chance that they're answering no to all those questions. And these questions are designed to make the candidate think, whoa, what if my money could wake up before me? What if my money could work when I'm not even working, when I'm on vacation? What if my money could work overtime? They're thinking about these things. So they're also validating themselves. It's not just you validating them, they're validating themselves. Because believe it or not, we're so blessed here on the highway to freedom to be able to answer yes to all of these questions. A lot of you know, you go to bed at night, and your profits may be in negative or the red, and by the time you wake up in the morning, you're like, whoa, yeah, baby. It's happened to me all the time. A lot of you know, I'm a, look, I'm on Columbia right now, still making money on vacation. And a lot of you do take vacations. The Kerwin go to Trinidad. I just went to Jamaica today. He's still making money, though. And the overtime thing, you, we know that we can't, I can't even stare at the computer screen as much as the money's moving. I have to go out and do something else or whatever. I can't, physically, I can't sit there and stare at the charts as hard as that money is constantly moving. We know the, the market is always moving. It's always moving from Sunday at the open to Friday in the afternoon. And we cannot work that hard. But that money does, though. The money does, though. So these are valid questions that you can ask the candidates and you all are in a position to be able to say yes to all these questions. So why wouldn't they want to be like you? Why don't you have, you do have the juice because you can answer yes to these questions. If they answer no, we move right down. The next thing you would say, the closeout, if the answer was no to any of these questions, above questions, ask the following. So boom, this is what you're going to ask next. If they say no to those questions, you're about, to, you're about to close out the deal with this. Ask them how would you like to, ask them how you would like to, oh, I got to go rewrite this website, man. Ask them how would you like to change the answers to the above questions to yes. How would you like to be able to change the answers to the above questions to yes? And you wait for them to respond. Whatever they say, you know, they're going to, because when they respond, they're basically, they're selling themselves, really. That's what they're doing. When they say, yeah, man, I would love to be able to change it, man. Am I big on vacation to make money? And da, 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 da. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I'm killing myself with this job, trying to work overtime and all this. They're going to start talking. You know what I mean? They're selling themselves by the questions you're asking. I did a video one week and I, I said, sales is not about how much information you can talk about. Notice this thing, we're asking a bunch of questions. We're not here selling them. We're not saying, man, you gotta do this Forex, man, we making money, man. We, this thing we sales off the hook, we got 9,000 pips, man. Oh man, we doing all, we're not doing all that. We're asking questions. We're asking questions. And letting whatever the questions are will tell us how to make the sell or will allow the person to sell themselves. But it's the person who makes the, the sales is the person who know how to ask the right questions. So many people think sales is about how much information you can feed and how much you can talk. It's not about that. It's the same thing when I was selling life insurance. I didn't go in there and talk to Ms. Johnson and, yeah, Ms. Johnson, you need to get this life insurance because you know your people going, you're gonna die one day. Your people, no, 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 no. I would sit in there and pretty much be shut up the whole time with Ms. Johnson talking my head off. I'm like, oh boy, I'm, I'm in a situation, I'm trying to get out the house. Ms. Johnson just running the mouth, running the mouth, running the mouth. And I love it. Go ahead, talk, Ms. Johnson, because you're talking yourself into an insurance policy. I just knew how in the beginning to ask the right questions. Wow, Ms. Johnson, how long have you been in this neighborhood? Whoa, man. So I'm sure you know a lot of people, don't you? The more I get her talking, the more she's, just, I'm, one, I'm making a friend with her. Two, she's just opening up to me. So I'm aligning myself as to be, you know, a friend or a partner or whatever the case might be, or a beacon of light, a beacon of hope. The answer to whatever the things that she's, questions or doubts in her mind about whatever the situation might be. In this case, it's money. It's money. Everybody want to make money. 
but we're doing it by asking the right questions. It's key, okay? The next question you would ask, after you ask them how they would like to be able to change the answers to the above questions to yes, then you would ask them another powerful question. What would you do with that extra time or money or both? And you let them answer the question. Guys, they're gonna start thinking about, man, I would just travel the world or I would be able to take care of my kids and put them through college. I would buy this brand new car I've been dreaming about. You know, the list goes on and on and on and on and on and on. But the power in that, you're giving them the opportunity to think about it, to talk about it, to share it with you. And like it says right here, you are finding out another hot button, their dreams. So you know who you're dealing with. You know what it is they want. So that, in essence, you can give it to them. See, when you try to sell somebody by giving so much information and all the things that make you happy, you're not doing nothing for that person because that person does not care about what it is you making you happy. They might care, you know, down the road, but they don't care as much as they care about themselves. So what's the point of just running out the mouth about all the things you feel is great about Forex or the things that you feel could benefit from Forex for them? No, let them tell you what is the powerful part about the opportunity that they just heard from the Sunday night webinar by asking the right questions, by opening them up. Women, don't you like the man who listens, who can listen to you, who can talk and like, oh my God, he listens to me. He lets me talk. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's, it's just the real essence of it. You like that guy. And you, you pour your heart out to him. When you can find a man like that who just listens to you, simply listens to you. Now, hopefully that man know how to ask the right questions of you that open you out and make, you know, because if, he, if, he's, if he's a good salesman, <laughs> he know how to ask the questions. You tell him the answers and he give you what you want. He gives you what you want. So what do you like to do for fun? Oh, I like to go out to eat at this nice restaurant. I'll probably buy that a week or two, you go into that restaurant. There's a method to the madness. <laughs> but that's the essence of that's the beauty of it. And we have the opportunity to do the same thing and make this process so smooth, so sweet, and we can give people what they want. That's what it's all about, right? We here to positive, we're here to help people, we're here to change lives, we're here to share this opportunity, we're here to you know, we can, the key word, the philosophy, if I can help enough people get what they want, I can have anything in the world that I want. And, you know, I feel that my success and our success is truly based off of that. When we can take our eyes off of ourselves, help enough other people get the things they want, then like I'll keep talking about this effortless thing, the things you want start to come effortlessly. You start getting blessed, you're like, whoa, how am I getting... This is a beautiful day. Like, how did that happen to me? I don't know. Wow. Oh, man. Because you decided to take your eyes off yourself and help other people get what they wanted. So naturally, you know, the law of nature returns that blessing to you. It's hard to go out there and work for yourself. It's, that's work. I got to go work to get this money. I can get to pay my bills. I got to do it. It's easy to help other people, though, in essence, if you understand what I mean. It's easy to take your eyes off yourself, but it's the part that most people don't do. We're all focused on ourselves because in essence, yeah, I'm trying to do me. You gotta do me. Get yours. These are the words we heard in our life growing up. You better do you, you know? Who cares about them? I'm trying to get minds. But that's, we gotta make a, a mental shift if we want things to come to us without the effort of it. That's the key of, that's what I want this team building thing to be for everybody. I want it to be effortlessly because that's really the thing that most people don't want to do. Yeah, we, we, a lot of you join not because of team building. You join because you say, all right, I'll get down because I can make some money with this Forex. I don't know about that team building thing. Yeah, all right. So if we don't really 
gonna be doing that anyway, but we do understand the power of it. A lot of us, we understand the power of the team building. We see how that, man, if you can simply share this opportunity with 50 people, guys, that's an extra $5,000 a month, residually. What can't you do with $5,000 from the network market to the affiliate side, and then you're also building your investment account? Guys, I hope you see the power in this opportunity. Because you literally going to put yourself in a position to change your life in a way that I think most of you don't even realize. Don't even realize how you can have a life change with the opportunity we have. Look, 20 people a month is an extra $2,000 a month. That's minus the two, so $1,800 because you're going to pass up two. Okay. So $1,800 a month. And remember, they're passing up people to you as well. So it becomes even more effort. Look, let's say in six months it takes you and you get 100 people a month. Well, let's say it takes a year. And you have 100 people paying you a month. And the way we're growing, I definitely see that happening for some of us here. Guys, that's an extra, let's say 100 people, that's an extra $9,800 every single month. Just on one part of the opportunity. Now, you can take some of that $9,800 and feed it into your investment account, which is going to bring you some other crazy amounts of money. Ah. <sighs> I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. And if you follow this system that we have with this entourage, I feel that it can be effortless. Keyword, effortless. Effortless. Not like traditional network marketing. All right, we're going to close out. I'm about to close out 1020. I think I'm doing it good for my standards. The last, the last one, if you feel they're ready to go, close them out right there. So when we say close them out, they're ready to go. Hey, man. Oh, man, I can live the life. I can travel. I can just, oh, what I got to do to sign up, man? I'm ready to go. Send them your link. Send them your link. The National Wealth Center, you have a link that you can share with people that they can join your team. Send me your link. Say, you know, sign up right there. You can even go to highwaytofreedom.com. I'm working on getting another website more professional. I've heard it. The website's not professional, Shane. You got to do something, man. Come on, Shane. <laughs> But that website, highwaytofreedom.com, will at least show them the steps with pictures. Let me just show it to you. How about that? It'll show them the steps with pictures on exactly how to sign up. Let me show you what I'm talking about real quick. Because, you know, some people, they're more visual, and they need to be walked through the process. So um, that's why we have that one second. I want to show you guys what I mean when I say it gives them like the steps with the pictures from National Wealth Center on how to sign, how to sign up. Of course, my computer is going to be slow right now. Okay, here we go. Okay, you see what I'm talking about? So it breaks it all down for them on how to sign up. It shows them the pictures, all that, you know, everything, everything. It explains all, all those things, the pictures. So if you want to send them there, you can, or if you want to talk them through it, if you feel like you don't want to send for somebody to this. And we, me and the leadership are talking. We, we, want, we got some things to work. So those of you who've been with us for a while, you know, when we talk and we say we need to do something, we do it. So best to believe that we're going to make this more of something attractive. When we first started this, we just wanted to get it going. So we just put it out there and said, let's just get it going. There's a saying, you don't have to be great to start, but you have to start if you're ever going to be great. So we got it started. And we're going to keep improving as we go. But this does, you know, tell people exactly how to sign up. Matter of fact, this is explaining it. But this part down here, how to get started there. If they go to the how to get started part, it explains every little detail of what they got to sign up and blah, 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 blah. Now, this links them to my page. So you tell them don't sign up. Like, don't click that link because that's going to link them to me. But at least it'll tell them, you know, if you want to use it, if you want to use it. It's up to you. But I don't think many people have been having a problem with the sign up process. It's not that complicated. It's not that complicated. All right? So if they're ready to close out, you close them out right there. If they're not ready to go, tell them. Um, if they're not ready to go and they have some questions or concerns, then what you do, you do a three-way call with your sponsor or 
or your mentor or somebody you feel can explain to help you out to close the deal. Let me just read what it says. If they're not ready to go, tell them so far they have been pre-qualified and the last phase of the qualification is a three-way with a top leader. Set up the day and time. Be sure to give the three-way call leader all three hot buttons. So if you're going to do a three-way call with your sponsor or your top leader or whoever you feel could help you close the deal, call that leader first. Let the leader know the hot buttons of your candidate. Then you do the three-way call with your candidate. You want to give your leader a heads up. You don't want to just surprise them. You want to give them a heads up and let them know that, okay, I have this person and blah, 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 blah. These are their hot buttons. And, you know, um, then you go from there. All right? And like it says right here, reap, reward, and repeat. Just keep re repeating that process over and over. Now, I'm going to tell you, not everybody, not everybody's going to sign up or whatever, but it's just a matter of the law of averages and repeating this process over and over. And it could be so smooth, so sweet, so simple and people will be tracking and hunting you down, okay? So that's all I have for tonight, and I went right off of the information, right off the websites that we have, the h2fentourage.com. You guys can go check it out for yourselves. You wanna study it and just kinda of go over there. It's a matter of putting people in the Facebook group and following the steps on the h2fentourage.com page, and you should see some success. I want everybody to at least have one person so that you're not paying anything to be here. This is all about making money. So if you get simply one person, you at least break even on the business ownership side of our opportunity. With that being said and done, does anybody have any questions before we close out for the night? Let's see, we got a chat. Cool ruler. Okay, thanks, man, thanks. I'm glad uh, you got some value out of the, the information. Cool ruler, cool ruler. Salute, Donnie. I see you doing your thing, Donnie. I've been seeing your name pop up a lot. Keep on rocking and rolling, man. Keep rocking and rolling. All right. Any questions, any concerns before we close out? All right, guys. Well, it's been a pleasure. It's been real as always. And uh, let's see what this market going to do for us between now and 4 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time tomorrow. Sometimes we have an awesome Friday. So, Let's see if we can, you know, see, let's see what happens. Let's see what the market's going to do. We got some positions open, and uh, it'd be nice to wake up the money, as we always say. All right, guys, it's been real. Have a good night, and uh, we'll talk to you next time.